You ever find yourself constantly refreshing your email or checking your website just to see if someone filled out a form? It's kind of a pain, right? Well, I've got a way to fix that. What if I told you that you could get those form submissions sent directly to your Discord channel instantly without having to lift a finger? It's super easy and I'm about to show you exactly how to set it up in just a few minutes. So let's get into it. First, I'm going to head over to the integrations tab from the Fluent Forms Pro dashboard. Now I'm looking for the Discord integration. When I scroll down, it'll be tricky to find it as Fluent Forms offers tons of integration. I'll just search Discord and there it is. Just need to turn it on. Simple, right? With just one click, the Discord module is activated. Next, let's switch over to Discord. If you don't have a server yet, no worries. You can create one by clicking the plus icon. But since I already have a server, I'm going to use that. Now, I need to create a new channel for these notifications. This is where all my form alerts will pop up. I'll name it something like uh, form alerts, but you can call it whatever makes sense for you. Now that the channel is set up, it's time to create a webhook, which will connect Fluent Forms to Discord. Let's get into the settings of the channel. Click on integrations and then hit create webhook. Discord gives me a unique URL for this. This is important, so I'm going to copy it because I'll need it in the next step. All right, back to Fluent Forms. I'll open up the form I want to connect to Discord. Under the form settings, there is an option to add new integration. I'll click that, select Discord from the dropdown, and now it's time to paste in the webhook URL I copied earlier. From here, I'll give this integration a name. Maybe something simple like um, Discord alerts and choose which form fields I want to send to Discord. For example, I'm picking the person's name, email and a brief summary for what they submitted. You can customize the message if you want to add even a footer text. And if you want to get fancy, you can use conditional logic. This means the notification only gets sent when certain conditions are met. Uh, for instance, I can set it up so I only get an alert if someone selects a specific option on the form. If you want a more detailed view, you can go ahead and click right here. I'll also drop the link in the description below, so make sure to check it out. Once I've got all of that set up, I'll click save. And that's it! Everything is connected now. To test it out, I'll go ahead and submit a form myself. Within seconds, I see the notification pop up in my Discord channel, just like that. No more checking my email or refreshing my site, everything comes straight to Discord automatically. So there you have it. In just a few minutes, I've automated my form submissions using Fluent Forms and Discord. If you're tired of manually checking your forms, this setup is a lifesaver. Give Fluent Forms a try and make your life fluent.